Triad product specialist here at Kinsey, and today we're going to talk about wiring for the Blue Vantage display and tablet on the tractor side of hookups. So we're going to start with our battery power cable connection. So our battery power connection, which if you look at the tag on the front, is labeled A25030. This one has a large metal Deutsch end on it and then has two ring terminals on the other end that go directly to tractor battery power. So this can be routed however it uh, works on your machine, but it needs to be directly to battery power or hot all the time connection. Once that's installed, this connection will basically sit behind the tractor cab, really on top of the hydraulic valve stack on the back of the machine. So once that's installed, your other power connection or your extension harness which again has a label on it as well. And this one is A25032. This one is really the connection point from the hitch of the planter to this power connection on the back of the tractor. This is our 3660 planter with blue drive behind us. 4900 will have a very similar connection, just mounted up a little higher on that machine. This cable can be connected directly to the front of the planter hitch. <clears throat> The nice part is it's keyed, it only goes together one way. So once you lock that one in, you can take your power cable that you just installed and connect those two together. Okay, so basically we got our hitch of our tractor, our short power extension connected to our power all the time connection that's hooked to the battery of the tractor. Now, if we go into the tractor cab, we start with <clears throat> our display harness cable, which is 25031, okay? This one has several connections on it. The first one you notice is pretty familiar. It's our convenience plug end. We're gonna go into any convenience plug that's in the tractor, and we're gonna connect that to that connection point. If we follow our harness down, we're going to have two connections that we need to worry about. One is a two pin connector and the other one is a round single red wire on it. Okay, Since we're probably in the tractor cab attaching our convenience plug in, if you go to the Blue Vantage dock, okay, you have this mounted into the tractor cab on your monitor rail, there is a power inverter on the top. Okay? It's our black box. You can see right here on the side is the port for that long single red wire. So single red wire, it's got a small fuse holder. You're going to simply connect that to our power converter. And then after you have it installed, I would take a zip tie and zip tie that single harness to this holder to help keep it from unplugging. Once that's installed, it's in your tractor cab, you're gonna follow your harness down to your next two pin connection point. Outside of the tractor cab on our valve stack, on our power cable that we installed, again, goes directly to battery power. There's a two pin connection. <clears throat> it's labeled as P1 console power. This one is also labeled power relay for power console. They are the same wire colors, black and blue, black and blue, connect those two together. Okay. <clears throat> After you have those connected, the only other two cables to connect is number one, your ethernet cable. So in your display package, ethernet cable has the small four pins in it, has your spin on ends on each end of it. <clears throat> Coming out of the dock, you have two cables. One is a nine pin serial cable, which is gonna be for your GPS receiver cable which talks about in the instruction sheets, depending on which GPS receiver you're using, that's where you're gonna plug your GPS receiver into. But since we're gonna plug in our ethernet, we're gonna take our ethernet cable, just simply attach them together at the dock, and then you're gonna route the ethernet cable out of your tractor cab, out of your window, or out of the back window, and again, on each blue drive machine, there'll be the ethernet cable connection here. Just simply rotate it until it fits in there. Screw that connection in and your ethernet cable is connected. You're ready to hook up your Blue Vantage display and ready to go. 
Any other questions, please see our other YouTube videos or contact your local Kinsey dealer.